Hi everyone, welcome to another hair video. Sorry I've been away so long. Oh my gosh, I missed you guys. Alright, so today we're doing something a little bit different. We're putting on a curly U-part wig from Nadula Hair, 24-inch Brazilian hair with 150% density. It came with a band and a wig cap, which we're not going to use because I'm going to braid this. Um, everything's gonna be in the description below. That's why I was pointing. But this hair, it's so cute. It's giving that like deep, curly island girl vibe. Here's a closer shot of the curls in the hair. Very soft. I love Nadula hair. This is the second wig I've had from them. So yeah, I actually ordered everything from their Amazon, not their direct website. It came in like a day and I'm actually very excited about this hairdo because I'm, I barely wear wigs. Like if you've been on my channel, you've been watching my hair videos, I've only been doing like just natural hairstyles. So I was like, let me just do something new. But yeah, so here's me partying some leave out. When I've watched other people do this wig style i've seen people just braid all their hair in and then clip it in but for me personally i wanted to just leave a little bit of hair out because i know that my natural hair can actually blend in with the texture of the wig if i just you know put a little bit of magic on my hair so that's what we're doing so i'm just parting my hair on both sides All right, so now that I'm done with the party, I'm gonna do one little lazy braid in the middle just so I can leave this hair clip and just away from everything. Um, next, I'm gonna part. I wanted to braid small, but I didn't have a lot of time for this as well. And I felt pretty confident in how I braid to the point where I can actually do like big parted braids and they'll still be flat. So honestly, if you're thinking of braiding your hair under a U-part wig, it's really up to you if you wanna do like big braids, small braids. I was being lazy and we're just doing big braids all around. I believe I had like, um, probably like what, eight? eight or nine braids all around my head and you couldn't even tell that it was all wasn't even bulky or anything in the back but anyway that's me i didn't really care about the parts as well because like i said this is all going to be under the wig and it's really just to protect my hair under the wig and yeah you know all that that so yeah I'm gonna do all the rest in the, around the head, and here's the finished product. Cute, cute. Onto the wig. So, the U parts that I've been ordering have been coming like attached, so just cut it off. Just cut these little things off, and then you have clips. So, usually, I'm actually very much used to wearing wigs that have like the clip on as if you were wearing clip on extensions but i love how nadula's wigs actually just have a comb where you can just attach it into your hair and it doesn't move and i feel like it's actually a little bit more comfortable and it doesn't put that much tension on your head because that's one thing that i hate about wearing 
wigs or clip-ins like when I try to lay down like my it just feels like something's just like on my head so I love this I love that so after you just put the wig on take out the leave out hair spray some water you can get one of these water bottles sprays from the beauty supply Walmart dollar store whatever um, sells these and you know just part your hair to your liking I'm always a middle part girl so you know that's my go-to that's my favorite and I just want to make sure that the part looks um, as straight as possible so that I could blend in my natural hair with the wig I know I should have colored this wig before I got it but to my discretion I actually just wanted to get this video out I am going to be coloring it very soon probably before like one of my trips or anything so yeah just spray 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 your real hair spray the wig spray 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 water is what you need to perfect this style i also very much recommend using olive oil or gel to you know just make sure that your hair doesn't like frizz up or anything on to my favorite part edges i like doing these like wavy type edges i don't know why it just makes it look like water in my head for some reason i don't know but here's the finished look and here's me all dolled up look at the bounce 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 slow-mo you guys click that link in my bio buy this hair and the hair so good so soft love it you're not gonna regret purchasing it make sure you guys like comment and subscribe and i'll see you in the next video bye